Hey guys, good morning. So today I'm headed to the nail salon and I decided to do a nail vlog only because this has been so requested. You guys wanna see how I do my nails, what it is, everything. And I don't really do a great job at explaining because I really just don't know. So I'm gonna take you guys with me, show you guys her steps, her method, what she uses and show you guys how I get my nails done. So right now, this is what they look like. I'm gonna get these soaked off and get a fresh set I wanted kind of like a meat, a milky color. I'm gonna put my inspo on the screen. All I do is go on Pinterest, show her what I'm going for, and she makes it happen. Oh, also, I'm gonna be doing a voiceover for the clips only because it's gonna be pretty noisy in there. I don't wanna have to be worried about customers talking and like the drill and all that stuff. So it's gonna be a voiceover. Hope you guys don't mind. So here are my nails right now. This is basically the before. I've had this set on for a couple weeks. So it's time for them to get changed and everything. And how they remove the gel is basically by filing it down. I did not have to soak. I thought I did, but the way how you remove this sort of gel is by filing it down. So moving on to the products that she uses, the pink one is the color that I'm getting and the clear one is the builder gel. So what she does with the builder gel is basically just put like one layer on my natural nails and I guess that's to straighten my nails. That's basically what she's getting ready to do right now. Just putting one coat of the clear one on my fingers and I'm basically just going to cure that in the little UV light for a few seconds and then she's going to start with the forms and all of that. So onto the forms, what she's doing is basically putting this thicker paper thing and this is what they use to form a nail. So this footage got really messed up because of the angle, I'm so sorry, but what they basically do is put the sticker on and then use the gel to form a nail with the sticker, if that makes any sense. I will link a video in my description box to a video showing the full process. That way you guys can have a better understanding, but that's basically what she's doing for me. So after the nails have been formed, she removes the tape and now she's just adding some extra gel on top just to make sure that the nail is thick enough and the surface is even and everywhere is covered. So that's pretty much what she's doing right here. So now she's just wiping the nails off with some rubbing alcohol, I believe, or acetone, just to wipe off that sticky feeling. And now we're getting ready to file. Now, being that the gel is so thick, it takes a while to just shape everything and bring it down to where it needs to be. So filing took a long time but I don't mind because they always turn out so perfect so yeah we're basically gonna be filing for a couple minutes and 
making sure that they're shaped nicely and all of that. So after filing, now we're getting into the shaping portion, which takes another couple minutes. But she's a perfectionist and I like that. So she takes her time and makes sure that the shape is literally like perfect. So that's pretty much what we're doing right now. She's switching between the drill and the filing thing to kind of shape and make sure that everything is smooth. So pretty much this is what the shape is looking like. The first hand is completed. Now she's just working on the other hand. And pretty much this is what the shape is looking like right now. I love it. Love it so much. So afterwards, she just applied the top coat. I just took my hands off for a second to show you because I didn't get any footage of that. But right now, I'm basically just curing my nails in the UV lamp thing. And I do that for a couple seconds, a minute or two, I think, actually. And yeah, pretty much that's all I do. And now she's just going to put some oil on my cuticles. That's what you see her doing right here. And yeah. So for this portion, I'm basically following her to the back to the sink where she does a hand scrub for me, which feels amazing, makes my hand feel so soft. So basically, she's just gonna be applying the scrub to my hand and I'm just gonna rinse it off in the sink. After which, she will just give me a little hand massage, which feels so divine, so nice. So now I'm back with a warm towel and I basically keep my hand in there for a few seconds and then she basically just wipes my hand, which feels so relaxing, you guys. I never thought a warm towel would just feel so nice, but so yeah, she's basically just wiping off the excess oils or any scrub residue that's left over in preparation for a picture. She wanted to take a photo of my nails, so that's what we're going to be doing soon right after she oils my dry hands again my hands are so dry you guys it's so embarrassing but yeah she's basically just going to massage my hands a little bit and get ready for the picture and she was nice enough to take a picture of my nails for me so this is the finished product of my nails I'll show you guys a picture at the end, but this is pretty much what they look like. On to the pedicure station. One last look at my nails there. I decided to go with the sweet orange pedicure. Um, I've never gotten this one before. I've gotten a few of them actually, but never this one. But yeah, right now she's just removing the old polish I had on my toes. I had a white and, you know, that's basically what she's doing down there, but they have so many pedicures to choose from at this spot, and they're all so unique. I love reading the little things. There's a birthday girl one, one that's called Caribbean Fruits, Take Me on Vacation, really fun stuff. Here she's just pushing back my cuticles and just cleaning my toe and everything like that, getting rid of like dead skin and you know, the regular pedicure stuff. That's what she's doing right here. And now she's just doing a citrus scrub on my legs, 
which felt amazing and yeah that's pretty much what she's doing right here and she was using the peels of the orange it kind of like it was just so nice you guys i felt like a princess i'm not gonna lie i loved every second of it so yeah and my skin feels so soft right now as i'm making this recording so here we have a little foot massage that she gave me it's complimentary with the pedicure i chose it felt so good so she did this for 10 minutes and then she followed up with a hot stone which oh, felt so good so good and i didn't film any footage so this is from instagram now she's just gonna polish my toes and that's pretty much it okay guys so you've reached the end of the video i hope you guys really enjoyed it i tried my best to film while she was doing my nails it was kind of difficult but i think i got some good clips and enough for you guys to kind of understand the method and what she does yeah i'm completely pleased with my nails they're a lot shorter than i usually get because i kind of i'm tired of the long nails so got them a little bit shorter but yeah i'll be doing this a lot um more and each time i do it i'll try to you know work on the angles and all of that but thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it and i'll see you guys in my next video Bye.